Hello YouTube. This is the different ends I've made for my little machinist hammer. This is aluminum. I've showed this one of the first ones I made. It's kind of like a ball peen. It's not perfect. This was kind of hand formed. Kind of hard to explain. I just kept changing the angle and the lathe bit would be at a different angle. Then it was actually filed with an old file which does plug up your file, aluminum does. And then it was different grits of sandpaper to smooth and shape it, okay? So then we made these. These are a 20 degree angle. I messed up on this one is why it has a step to it. This was more accurate. I had it draw it out on paper and messed up. But these are 20 degree on each side. That's the nylon plastic. This is the 12L14 steel. These are little pieces of bolt and I put double nuts and locked them in there so it would stay in here. Then this is the one I made today. This is 12L14, so it's steel. So if we want to, we can put, we can take both aluminum off. Kind of hard to do left-handed, but we still have to make a bolt for this. We have to go to the hardware store. So we can have all steel like that. Here, let's do this a little easier. We can have the plastic nylon. Like that. So we can have either nylon and I don't think I'll make aluminum one of this. We can have nylon or steel or this type of aluminum and we're not going to make a ball peen type steel one because we have ball peen hammers. So this ought to get me by for things I want to do. This could maybe work on soft copper or soft aluminum. It is a hard plastic. It's nylon. I have got it from online metals is the supplier I got it from. It is a nylon that's reinforced with something. So you see all the nice swirly stuff in there. But we'll take some pictures so you can have some up close pictures of what they look like. And thanks again for watching.